Hi everyone, welcome to Ansible Tower Learning Series for Network Engineers. This is the seventh video on Ansible Tower Learning Series. In this video, we will see how to install Tower CLI, how to configure it, and execute commands from Tower CLI for triggering the jobs or other tasks. This is the documentation of Ansible Tower CLI. So, we can see here it is a command line tool for Ansible Tower. This can be installed using pip install Ansible Tower CLI. Once we install it, we can register it using Tower CLI config command. In the previous video, we have seen how to install and register GitLab runner from Ansible Tower. Now, GitLab runner can run CACD pipeline to execute any command in the tower. So now in this video we will install tower CLI in the tower and then using CACD pipeline we will execute the job the trigger job task in the Ansible tower. So now we will see how to install tower CLI and then in the next video we will see how to trigger it using CACD pipeline. So to configure it tower CLI config you can see the options here here it says configuration will be stored in user home dot tower CLI dot CFG and if globally is used it will store in etc tower tower CLI dot CFG file now to configure it we can execute the command tower CLI config host and the host IP 0 0.93 is the tower IP then tower CLI config username admin and then password verify SSL false so once this is done we can verify the configuration here So this got updated here now if we need to execute any command in the tower tower cli user list this will print all the available users in ansible tower host list will print all the available hosts in the inventory then job underscore template list will print the available job templates you can see the IDs of the job templates here now if we need the project list So these are the projects now if you want to run a particular template tower CLI job launch then hyphen job template and the template ID we need to give it is we will try running this id 15 and we will give verbose and before that we will verify that in ansible tower so the template number to see the template number if you mouse over you can see below and if you click on the template you can see the template number here as well 
now we will try triggering this template and last executed job was 190 so we will try triggering from tower CLI now so job ID is 192 and its status is pending now it is executing this playbook gets the facts of the device we can see it here routers details it is getting and launched by admin and now this is completed if you want to see the status of that particular job tower CLI job we can see the status here now it is successful so in this way we can use tower CLI to execute command in Ansible tower and in the next video we will try triggering this tower CLI from CACD pipeline and in CACD pipeline we have already registered this as a runner GitLab runner here we can see we have registered tower as a GitLab runner and from here if any commit happens to particular file will try triggering the respective templates we'll see those details in the next video i hope this video was helpful for you to understand basics of ansible tower cli thanks for watching see you in the next video